Right, welcome to Oldbridge Farm, episode 46, I believe. Um, today we're going to have everybody working, but before I start, I just want to have a quick word. Don't stand too close to the monitor. I have a cold, I don't want to give it to anybody. You have been warned. But any gaps in the sound on the recording will be me trying to get rid of any sneezing or coughing I have to do. <coughs> and if my voice sounds strangely odd it's the result of the cold. Well why of course a cold I call it man flu. Right for the first time we have a full crew on. Yes that's a surprise isn't it? We have Charles back. I'm just gonna do this and I bought this little do that to feed the chickens with now. I'm just gonna get everybody else started I'll just uh, pull this round here and Paul's going to put uh, alfalfa in, put an alfalfa in all the fields that has been uh, harvested. Looks like he's away. Uh, next is Kylie. Just this morning she's going to be doing carton as uh, she's off after this morning. She's getting ready for her trip to America. If you may remember, she won that trip and her child's in his new wagon. Uh, surprise, surprise, he seemed to have got a few hours on. He's been out a few days. I went to pick him up a couple of three days ago and uh, I told him he needed to come back at all until we start half the beat, but he decided he wanted to get go on today so I've got him lime in the fields but I am going to go down to the animal down the animals uh, once I've got this done we've got a little bit of lag at the moment but uh, I'm just going to collect the eggs and feed these some corn at long last or some wheat at long last Kylie's off to OEB with our With our wheat, uh, I'll park this in here, I think. I'll leave this loaded. We've got a contract for around 100 tonne of wheat to go in OEB. <coughs> We've then got, I think, all our, let's see how much we've got, uh, all our soil, I think, is going to decap. Uh, yeah, all 37 tonne of it. Not a lot, and the canola has got nowhere particular to go, so it'll be whoever's doing the best price on the rape. Uh, two, five, three. Uh, look, ah, oh. the pub looks of it is doing best for the rape, so before that still holds, whether she get all those done is another matter, but uh, she's going to do what she can before she leaves to get ready to off to America, in uh, which we, case we ain't going to see her for about five or six weeks. Right, that's that done, so as everybody's busy, oh, collect the eggs. Don't forget to collect the eggs. That's it. We've got all those. I have to remember to sell those off at some point. Hi, I was I was like, quite often do walking through the village the other day actually to uh, get some stamps to post a letter. Um, and I saw Councillor Mrs. Crawford Brown. I uh, just crossed the road, uh, not to get out of the way, I didn't know she was there until I crossed the road. I just looked back, she smiled at me, not a pretty so. And she said something like, Gotcha. I don't, I haven't a clue what she meant. But we will probably find out at some point. Yes, and Charles is delighted with his new tractor. He has already put a few hours on. I wasn't certain how, as he hasn't been at work, but uh, the lady ship came to see me last night and said he'd been a great help. He'd been working the last three days. 12 hours a day at the riding school, getting things sorted out, handy, you know, odd jobs done. 
I only actually found up some straw. I didn't think too much of it. I checked our stocks and found we're ten tons short. Oh well, <sighs> that's Charles for you. So I've got. He's going to be very busy liming everything. Um, we're going to get every as much done today as we can before we start the uh, the beet harvest. We might have two visits here to get this lot done. Yeah, Lord, she sold the first lot. We're in. I sold the milk this morning already. Uh, I think we we do is we go and put some mixed ration around first. And some straw around everything. If we need straw and oh Charles is finished so I better sort him out. Get which one to be on next. Almost everything wants lime. Um, well, I think we put them on the uh, twelve next. Let's just hook up to this first because I came in there away last time. I'm hoping this poor little tractor will do the job. But, and often you see all of our tractors out at once. Sit him filling up and I've gone. No, oh, Charles. Yes, it looks like everything needs some mixed ration. Isn't so much this I'm worried about, it's when we come to put water on. So, yeah, put the brake on. He's doing. Oh, by the way, I have put a different texture on the, the uh, fields just to uh, change things about a little bit. Uh, let's see, 12. That is. Certainly a little bit, uh, oh, a clover. Yeah, how about that? We didn't have a face to face. Carly's going to be trying to get on as quick as she can with her work. As soon as she's done, I told her she can go. Shouldn't be too bad, only about seven or eight load to deliver. Shouldn't take her long. Let's put this on the 12 this is. This is 12 north. Right, let's hope we've got one for this. Um, This side, yes, it's this side. Let's find it. I have to, I should just have to get this one done. If not, we'll have to come fill it up again. And you see, the weed texture now is a little bit more colourful. See where it starts. It's driving across. This is because the seat with the uh, independent front wishbone suspension, just from the uh, gold pack. There we go, I still haven't got round to putting crop destruction back on them. I really must do that. Let's get back to mine. So, that was 
thought I would see it, but I said it looked a lot worse. In here, and Muck's beginning to build up again, but it's not quite bad enough to do this shit. That's got rid of the carriers off there. And we had word that the bridge will be repaired this winter, so uh, that will be out of commission for I think a month. Was a uh, pull it apart and rebuild it. Luckily they're not going to put a flat bridge and they're going to keep the hump back. But in the meantime, we have been told to go steady. Oh yes, uh, other news, the wife has been made chairman or chair of the local the WI. She's quite chuffed with that. Well, no doubt I'll be seeing less of her because she uh, attends to uh, WI business. For those who do not know, WI is Women's Institute. And the other thing we had was uh, I had a placement call around the other day. I thought Eloise after Charles already. It was actually yesterday. Uh, so, uh, what Charles been up to? As one does. Uh, apparently, in the district, there's been some cases of uh, hair causing going on, which is highly illegal in Britain, as it should be. <coughs> Excuse me, my throat's gone a bit. Uh, which consists of uh, using long dogs, greyhounds, lurchers, and such like to try and catch a hare. The mere fact that here a game animals are not allowed to be killed by just anybody and they do no real harm. I love watching the hares in the spring on the farm. The dogs also they get to the hare first tend to tear a poor beast apart and people bet on it. Don't think of it. There is an animal as cruel as uh, humans. Oh, there's a bit more weight on the front. There's a bit more weight. God there. Oh, that's why we've got no weight on the front. Lovely weights, but they can sometimes, when you switch off, lose the weights. Well, look what we got left of this after being there. And I'll, uh, Charles and Renault will get this into the lamb shed and, and go on to fill him up again, let him finish off. Definitely could do with a bigger dry fertiliser spreader, but got my eyes set next so I don't think I'm going to be able to afford a new combine this year to get in another a second cultivator because we're going to be doing more and more cultivating right we just switch off don't want to leave that running in here what's he doing oh he's well getting well for it she must be getting well down too right it's Oh yeah, part of this pack is the texture pack that's slightly different textures for things like uh, the fertilizer. And that. Makes it a bit easier to see. I think I've come the wrong way. You can see better where I've been on this now. Yeah, I should have went up the other side. Never mind. Oh well. Let's 
straight across. Careful there, I think kind of be on the way back. She's empty at the moment. And there she is. Don't think there can be much left in there now. Taking him on the long route round. One and twelve, almost done. Hmm. That should be easier to go in here, I think. Well, it's got another load out, that must be about it. I think we might end up there on that. When she comes back, we change her over then to uh, the cart for the cart for the uh, sewing. Oh yes, and the <coughs> Carly and the guys of the world me and talked a bit of sense into me. And I'm going to follow BP's idea of having a co-rearing unit on the farm. As you know, originally I wasn't going to do it, but they've convinced me it's probably for the best. So, uh, come the winter we will be building one, and I know exactly where it's going to go. You know we've got two meadows the cows go into, but the second meadow, away from the milk side. We should not build one in there. Just, as we all find, we're all running a bit short of space. I don't want to use any more fields, although I am going to use that end of field 12, which is just grass at the moment. I'm going to put some trees in there. To make up for the hedges and trees are destroyed. That's one should as a custodian of the countryside. It's it's not mine. It's for everyone. No, all we're doing now is find out how far we got. Uh, ooh, because I hit the uh, post in the hedge. Always one, and just oh, she's unloading. I better get ready to get back. See which way it's going. It is the right way. This looks like the right one. Let's find out how far we've got. Don't want her over lime it. Yeah, it's getting back to the uh, air coursing. I hope we haven't any because it's very dangerous to tackle them beggars. I'll start them off here, he over limes, he over limes, I think. I need to get back and see. I run Kylie back, and he's just about done his first one. Right, let's stop her here. Change around there to uh, the, the cell elevator. And that should now be. So she's going to be done very quickly indeed. <laughs> we find it. 
There we are, that's so we... See what we had left in there. Uh, 12 tonne of wheat left, I'll leave that for now, I might sell that a bit later. We should have to sell all the soy to load of it. We might get this pack out on the road again for we need to get right down to the the milk cows. Probably have to put a couple of load in those at least. And our BP likes just to keep enough for a diet. I like to fill the eggs up so I can get a bone for a while. Have a restaurant. Right, I think we're doing quite well too with the idea of showing to put everything. I have done the milk this morning. And I did finish off what little of the harvest there was left, left last time, but apart from that, everything's been on screen. Oh, yeah, I need to pull this in. I've got the fruit to harvest and all, which I want to try and get done before we get on to the uh, beet. First, and then worry about those two. I might notice the track on Prime is clean as it's Charles come to that, but it's as new. I haven't actually got down and cleaned this. End of the last uh, day's work. I just think I don't really want to be this side. I don't want to try and put it in there. Start tipping out here, and then go and see those two. Right, we've got him first. He's got, he's got half a tank. You might as well go and do one next. I'm going to do two is on this field is just get that <coughs> the little uh, so I'll put some grass round bits with when mist so at the around the edges so it's not quite as bad <coughs> Filling up. So I don't know what's happened there. No. Ah. Is that the problem? Is the cover still on though?
No, oh, don't tell me she's missed the. Uh... Oh, I think she missed the trigger. Seven miles, not where I was going. Right, on to number one, and it's. Oh, well, we don't want any more. The one. The one 5.5. Not certain where the start point is, but. Yeah, right, good. So again, it should be just about empty there now. Now you can come out of here and start the reset. Uh, should I have to go and do number 10 next? Side again, of course, as always. Alright, work we've got left to do, hopefully, most before we get the beat, uh, uh, beat started. Is we have grass to mow. Fruit to pick, alfalfa to feed seed, and then it's my turn with the, uh, the, big, the big beet harvester. Just imagine when she gets back this time, it's, it's going to be empty there, right now. Where is this tent? Or 25 this one but this will do that's oh, okay so Another two load. Oh, we might as well. <laughs> Hello, speeding fine. What's going on there? Oh, great. Speed cameras. 
right our traps. Two on one either side the bridge. Brilliant. I'll just get this that I think I now know what the council was smiling at me about. Well, that will teach me to uh, keep the speed under 20 on those bridge on, on that bridge, especially. Could have been worth a hand though. That uh, the faster you go, the more they find you. as well it's only on this little one still it's an 80 pound fine it's I can't afford too many of those it's got the 14 tons to go in there I'm seeing what that's uh, left in the side of the soil so she might as well take that then she's only got Canola, which I think is going to the pub. which will be 10, eleven's to do, I'll do four next. So I'm setting up the next course for So we now got the uh, speed cameras. I hope that's just temporary more so. I a bit worried about the bridge. I'm not going to take it a bank loan for the uh, Collins. See what we do if we I'll let Kylie finish it off. Then we call the episode here and we'll finish this off in the next one. the opposite way to the way I'm pointing. I think we're finished off here for folks. So it's, uh, thanks very much for watching, subscribing, liking, commenting, and we'll finish this bit off next time. So cheerio for now. Cheerio.